Hello and welcome everyone to another episode. Yes, so it's been a while. I've been a little busy and been having a lot of problems with recording lately. And hopefully some of the problems are cleared up, but eh, who knows. So uh, I have finally gotten around to getting the rest of our Duna exploration and all that stuff basically just set up and I have a few launches that we'll be doing for the rest of this week and I'm hoping somewhere around this weekend or maybe around third or you know maybe not Thursday that that would be uh, tomorrow that, that that wouldn't work out so well uh, probably sometime around next week or if not like Sunday Monday something like that I think we'll be heading to Duna with all nine ships that have been constructed and hopefully everything goes well. This is going to be quite the task. I don't know if I'm going to be able to do every single thing, but you know, yeah, the, the, it, it's possible. That's, that's all I can say. Oh, it looks like we lost another engine. So I hope everyone had a great fourth weekend. Uh, yeah, it's a little late for the whole fourth weekend, but you know I had something planned. But yeah, what the people were blowing up fireworks all around my house, and I don't think it would make for a good video if I were to just basically have about a thousand fireworks going off. It sounded like a war zone outside my house, but. Ah, you know, yeah, I had a good weekend, birthday, all that other good stuff. I uh, got some good stuff for my birthday, and most of the stuff I actually needed. So it's it's funny because half of the time you get stuff that you just want, where it's like, uh, you know, uh, PlayStation games, or at least for us it should be computer games, or you know, just all kinds of things that you're don't exactly need but yet you really really want them uh yeah i, I just you know I, I got way too much stuff that in in most of the stuff is stuff that i really really needed um you know the one thing i've been also thinking about and i should mention is i was thinking about i don't know if it's you know even possible at least sometime in the near future possibly moving and kind of making this a little bit more active than what I have been that is something that's been up in the air and also I was kind of joking around my girlfriend and I was you know she was like oh well I would kind of enjoy doing videos with you and stuff like that but I really don't know what games we would play together and you know it would require her also having a computer to play on which she could play on my laptop but I, I, I don't know. I, I, that, that was just something that was more of a joke than anything. I don't know if she would even be able to uh, play any kind of games. I, I, I don't know. But it would be fun. That, that, that's the only thing I will say is it would definitely be interesting and fun. Let's see. All right, yeah. Now, I'm trying to do my burn a little bit higher because I know that this stage here isn't going to have enough to get us all the way into orbit and we're probably gonna have to use some of this fuel as well but I got high hopes that we can make it at least somewhat into orbit so let's see we gotta get up to about 200 as well so I don't know how well this is all going to get come together but eh, we'll, we'll see so th that that that's pretty much the gist of my weekend, basically just partying and, well, I shouldn't even say partying. I got a Kerbal Cake, for those of you who uh, are following me on Twitter, I uploaded a picture, and yeah, you know, that's some of the stuff. I might put the picture on here as well, and yeah, I, I've been trying to take shots of the moon and kind of just take some pictures of Saturn because Saturn is out right now, and I just haven't been lucky, and I've had some issues, and it was just insane. I also have a friend that's from out of town visiting as well. I have, 
uh, a few of my friends, they ended up moving all the way from New York to Washington State. So, they, you know, they came and, I, I, you know, we visited and hung out and that was pretty fun and it was nice to uh, catch up. So, but yeah, the, that, that's just the gist of my weekend and... You know, a few after you know a couple days here, and it's been pretty fun. That that's all I can say. It's been amazing. So it's always good. So I've been noticing as well on my channel that I can tell that a lot of people are getting a little bit wary when it comes to me uploading videos and having videos out. And I can't make any real promises right now for you guys because I const I don't want to constantly keep saying. Oh yeah, 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 I'll keep, I'll start uploading again like I used to. The summer is a very, uh, turbulent month, or turbulent time for me when it comes to uploading and just doing everything. It, it's a very, very turbulent time as far as doing this stuff. I have a lot of problems with my neighbors and it just a lot of things and it, it just becomes a even bigger problem than what it used to be so that that's where I'm going to sit with that I apologize that there hasn't been even as nearly as much as what used to come out and what used to come out way way long time ago but this is the best I can do right now I hope you guys understand and yeah so anyways I will see you once we get into orbits. And we've reached orbit amazing so yeah there's been a lot of changes that have gone on with this base not really anything too drastic but I did add on some extra things that I thought we would need one of them being uh, extra parachutes now the last time we went to Duna and we dropped off our base why is this rocking around so much just stay still there you go so last time we went to Duna uh, there was a few things wrong with this base one of them being that it did not have a sufficient amount of parachutes and also these engines were placed about right here which meant once they fired uh, they didn't work they didn't do anything at all which isn't what was really planned with that because these will fire once it lands I kind of have a landing site picked out for it too but I'm not sure 100% if we're going to be able to get there but that's another story and you know so far there, there's a few different things I added I, I changed around a few of the the solar panel designs and stuff like that I decided to kind of go with just static solar panels uh, I was also going to add some side ones too, but I, I don't know. I just kind of, I'm okay with the static ones. 
and you know this has got all the basic communications and all that stuff we have xenon even though we don't need xenon i like adding them on there it kind of adds a little bit extra to it it looks a little bit better i don't know that, that's just me but yeah so we got all four of these full uh and got two guys in our rover which we will have now two rovers like this and one massive rover on the surface a mobile uh i guess you could call them mobile laboratory but you know uh it, it, it's gonna be a pretty weird that's all I'm, I'm hoping that this thing will land correctly and we won't have any issues but i got some other things planned as well i think we're going to go with possibility of an asteroid capture i'm not sure yet it would be nice to be able to construct a little bit maybe catch an asteroid around duna i think that would be kind of cool and the only other thing we have left is i'm looking at the possibility of building a reusable lander and to take off from doing it as well I know it's not that hard to do but hopefully everything works out so anyways guys if you like what you see here subscribe there's always more to come to new people welcome and uh, yeah I will see you next time